Okay, my darling, so I'm gonna ask the following queen to step forward. They are Eden, please step forward. Eden, you are the only queen placing safe this week. Congratulations. We're gonna go over to the judges for some feedback for Eden. Who wants to go first? There you go, Chucky. Make some noise for Chucky Barton, though. This doesn't look good, and I offered to go first. It's because is Lola... that clipboard covering the boner, Chucky? Is it covering the boner? I'm joking. I'm joking. There is near clipboard big enough. Head right. What can we say? Uh, uh, the first, the performance. The thing that I looked for in the costuming for the performance was if you looked at me and said, I'm in the Eurovision, who am I? I instantly go, Scoosh! So that was very good branding. You did the choreo very, very nicely. One of the things we discussed was, I know because we're obsessed with Eurovision here, that was exactly the choreo from Scoosh. Nobody else would have known that. You could have thrown in a bit of like, you could have gone a bit off it if it made more sense for the space. But it was very calm, very fun, and opening the show is always hard. So well done for that. This look. Did you make this yourself? Absolutely. Of course you did, I. I. Is this because of a reaction to being told to be more masked last week? I was. It's petty, so I can, I can always, I can always appreciate petty, but I feel like if we're gonna do it, go all the way. Chest hair, chest hair, chest hair. Where is she? There's chest hair. Right, that's what I'm gonna say about that. Thank you very much. All I'm gonna say is, Eden, you're gonna face this challenge. You've set such a high bar for your runways that when we see anything that I don't think is in your wheelhouse, you either have to commit to it 100% or we're gonna say it's not up to that Eden standard. Unfortunately, although you look very fuckable tonight, it is not up to the Eden standard of runways and that's not a critique, it's a, you've set such a high bar that you always need to live up to it. So, well done on a good performance, well done on a good runway, but you have the challenge as all of your competitors have reminded you of so many wins to your name, so you must live up to that, my darling. Hello, dear. Now, which one were you again? Let me check. Can I, can I say that? Well done, no, I, no, I love the performance, but what I would say, darling, you've got people up there in the Anne Frank suite. You've got to play to them, my darling. You've got to, you've got to play to them. Because you play it to us. But you're mutable, that too much. But you've got to play it. Just remember, you've got an audience up there who want to be involved, my darling. So do not put them. And, and this look, you look like a homophobe in a Ryanair flight. If that's the look you're going for, you're banged on the head. Well done, my darling. <laughs> Do you know what? I loved the performance because it's like a song that so catches you. And you did sell, obviously, the look from head to toe like, for it. I think it was the thing, it was like the runway, like you said, it was just let down from the other ones that you've done. But obviously, we all need the challenges, and Gal, remember, I walked out in a green morph suit, so it can't be any worse than that. So you're all good, you're yeah. all good. <laughs> you are excused. Mason, go for Eden! You are free to next week, my darling. Okay.